We'll call him Mr. Pumpkin, all right, because a pumpkin's the biggest fruit on earth. Mr. Pumpkinhead has a pumpkin for a head, and he hides under your bed at night. He's supposed to scare us all, but he's not frightening at all. See, he's only very small and light. Mr. Pumpkinhead, get out from under my bed. Your candlelight is far too bright. Mr. Pumpkinhead, go scare next door instead. I want to go to sleep. Good night. Mr. Pumpkinhead has a hollow in his head and a candle there instead of a brain. He can't think a thought or take part in any sport. He's just not quite that sort. What a shame. Mr. Pumpkinhead, get out from under my bed. Your candlelight is far too bright. Mr. Pumpkinhead, go scare next door instead. I want to go to sleep. Good night. Mr. Pumpkinhead, he's a silly empty head, but be careful where you tread upstairs. You might squash him flat, squash him right into your mat, so what do you think of that? Who cares? Mr. Pumpkinhead, get out from under my bed, your candlelight is far too bright. Mr. Pumpkinhead, go scare next door instead, I want to go to sleep, good night. from under my bed your candlelight is far too bright Mr. Pumpkinhead go scan his door instead I want to go to sleep good night Mr. Pumpkinhead get out from under my bed your candlelight is far too bright Mr. Pumpkinhead go scan his door instead I want to go to sleep good night I said I want to go to sleep all right I want to go to sleep, good night.